Well, happy Valentine's Day to me. Look at all of these amazing presents and flowers, balloons, candy. This is amazing. Tampa J sure does spoil me. Hello everyone, welcome and welcome back. I'm Chris the Girl and this is Tampa J and today- That's the name, don't wear it out. Is Valentine's Day. This is my Valentine. Day. This right? is my Valentine, yeah, that's right. Today we are doing something that has been not only highly requested, but well, it's about time. It's about time we hash out the story of us, how we met, because it is actually quite a story and um, there's a lot of details and and I don't know, it's, it's, it's a whole thing within a thing and I'm really excited to finally, we are very excited yes. to finally share it with you all. I, I could have very easily shared this on my own and Tampa J could have done the same and I've had requests for that, but I can't do that. We gotta do this. We're finally gonna make together. it a thing. We're gonna make a video all yeah. all about it. Even though all if you, about there are some people that can probably figure it out, you know. Some of it, at least some of Those it together, yeah. Those who pay close attention and watch every video. Thank you by the way. There. Yeah. But we need to put it out in the universe. Yeah, our story from yeah. our mouths. And um, so Tampa J has his camera as well. He's Where'd filming the same thing and um, we're doing like different Same kinds of too. like different kinds of shots and whatnot but essentially obviously the story is the same so if you all decided to click on my video if you could do me a favor and also either watch Tampa J's video and or at least click on the video and maybe give it a thumbs up or a quick little comment or something like that I would really, really appreciate it. Jay would really, really yeah, appreciate thanks, it. Babe. I want to put that right up front here um, because we realize that it's the same. This one, this particular video is kind of the same thing, sort of. Um, but we both, this means a lot to us. It's yeah. the story of us, of our relationship, and we want to share that with you all. And um, so we didn't want to just save it for my channel, save it for Jay's channel. We wanted to put it on both of our channels because it's important to the both of us. So um, all of that, I wanted to set all of that up here at the very beginning. All that being said, if, if you wouldn't mind doing that, that would be really awesome because it's gonna, it'll help uh, Jay out as well. And me, and me too, so. Thank you. Anyway. All Very of that being said, of we're going to celebrate Valentine's Day. We're actually at our destination for tonight. And uh, well, I'll show you what that is in, in just a second. Fine here. dining. Fine dining experience. That we're gonna cook ourselves. Exactly, Chris the girl in Tampa J style. Okay, without further ado, let's get going and let's go. That's right, we're heading into the Publix, one of the many Publix establishments that we could choose from. We're gonna go get some ingredients for the food that we're gonna make tonight back in our apartment and we're gonna have a nice evening back at home with the Bella too. Publix doing some BOGO on Russell Stover's chocolates so you can buy one for your sweetie and buy one for yourself. That's a win-win situation as oh, far as I'm okay. concerned, yeah. Did I mention we're making a pizza? I don't remember if I did or not. Nope. If not, I'm gonna say right now, we're gonna make a pizza. We're gonna make a pizza tonight. We had a lot of debate about what we were gonna do. We decided on pizza. So we're gonna get some mushrooms. We both enjoy the mushrooms on the pizza. So this is a good start. We're also talking about pepperoni. And um, if you're new here, I don't eat meat. So the best option would be some kind of vegetarian, pepperoni of which I am not readily seeing over here so they may not have they may not have it here at Publix and we got some cheese as well cheese is a very important part of the pizza operation low sodium pizza sauce we, do a white sauce we could do a white sauce there's a lot of different options over here and this is the one that we're gonna go with because we both like the label and it's the most expensive one which we all know means Slurgy. it's gonna taste the best. It's always true, right? I got some bread also for the rest of the week and a little bit of watermelon, but we got, we found some dough, some pizza dough that they make here 
at Publix. There's no directions to it, so this is gonna be uh, an interesting endeavor, but hopefully there's something online that we can follow in terms of how exactly to cook this thing. All right, we have since made it back home, and look at what I got. I got a brand new gimbal, thanks to Tampa J, which I have desperately, desperately needed. You're welcome. Thank you, yeah. And I'm excited to try this one out. It looks really funky and weird. You can like put it around a tree branch or something. You sure can, yeah. You can do all kinds of stuff with it. So I'm very excited about this. Thank you. I'm gonna saute the mushrooms a little bit. Ah! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I am not the cook. I am not the chef. Looks good. Good. Do you yeah, we're gonna add chef? a lot of sauce. I like a lot of sauce. What Me about too. You? Yeah, same. All right. I'm gonna taste test it to make sure yeah. it's good. Oh, we should both do that. How's that taste? Good. So Bella said the same Bella's, thing. Bella thinks the same Good job, thing. Bella. Yeah, good. Good? <laughs> it tastes like cheese? Okay. Trying to mix it up. Mix it up. Get it. Oh, gosh. We gotta spread it out. Yeah, sure do. <laughs> it looks really good. I'm excited. It looks pretty good, huh? Yeah, it looks pretty good. Yeah, it turned out interesting. All right, we trying the pizza? Yeah. Here we go. Mmm. That's good. That's really good. Congratulations, good job. It turned out a lot better than I thought it would. Honestly, me too. <laughs> I've got a, a lot, lot worse pizza than this. Yeah. No, it's good. Really good. Testing, testing. One, two, three. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day, everybody. So we ate, and now it's time to spill the beans. Yeah. Pizza was really good, by the way. Delicious. Yeah, definitely would. Would ten out of ten would make again. So here we are. The story of us, how it began. Just so you know, we have two cameras going yeah. at one time. So if you see us. Mm -hmm. uh, looking back and forth, that's why. Again, we are putting this on both of our channels. Yep. So make sure you go, uh, if you're watching here, my channel, go give her a thumbs up too. Appreciate we'll it. We'll make it even. Yeah, appreciate it. That'll be yeah. our Valentine's gift from you all. And if you're watching over here, come on over, give me a thumbs up mm -hmm. and, and go give her a thumbs up. We'd really appreciate it. Thank yeah, you thank guys you. very much. And uh, welcome to Chris and Jay's Valentine's yeah. Day extravaganza. And, um, all right, how do we start? The story of us. The story of us. How do so we start this I, I would say that in general, the simple one sentence answer is that we met via the YouTube. The interwebs. Via YouTube. YouTube, yeah. Um, actually, YouTube. before I started my channel, um, I was personally watching a lot of YouTube, um, looking for different YouTubers and, and checking out different channels. And um, honestly, myself, like probably a lot of you out there, I found Tampa J through Adam the Woo, through the grapevine of the YouTubers, uh, as a lot of, a lot of us do. Um, so, I saw him in one of Adam's videos, um, actually in a couple of his videos, and I was like, who is that? Hmm, like, uh, mostly because I was searching for YouTubers, new YouTubers <laughs> to watch and whatnot. First I was all, like, who's this Tampa J guy? Thanks, Adam. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I don't even think Adam knows that, honestly. Um, <laughs> but uh, yeah, so I, I clicked on his channel to see what this Tampa J guy was all about. And the first thing I see is Friday the 13th, original see, Friday the 13th. I knew I had something to do with locations. that. Filming locations. And I, I was like blown away. Like, oh, whoa, hold on a second. You're telling me that this handsome guy likes oh. horror as well? <laughs> I'm blushing. I'm invested. So um, I started watching a bunch of his videos and... Um, I mean, it was certainly love at first sight for me, which right. I don't believe in, we don't believe in generally, but in this case, it was... Love at first sight. At and first we'll get sight. there on my side of the story. Yeah, but yes, exactly. It starts I, with me. Yeah. I never thought love at first sight was like a thing, but it, it is a thing because it, it truly was. It is. Like, I, I, I just knew instantly yeah. once I saw 
Jay that like, okay, I'm like, I'm all in, I'm all in here. <laughs> so, um, it was actually one of his Dragon Con videos, um, and we, ha we have the date. It was October the 5th. Okay. No, October the 3rd. Sorry, October the 3rd, October 2021. The 3rd was the first time we I commented other. on his dra one of his Dragon Con videos. And it, it's the Dragon Con video, so that would have been Dragon Con 2021. 21, so yeah. that would have been Labor Day weekend. So mm -hmm. this would have been a couple months. Yeah, about a month after that down happened. the road. Yeah, and yeah. I because there was someone on that video who cosplayed as the Blue Raja from Mystery Men. Such a great movie. Yeah, and I was like, yeah. whoa! Like when I watched the video, I was like, oh my gosh, I've never seen a Blue Raja cosplay before. Um, yeah. So I commented. That was the first comment that I ever put on any of his videos. Was the blue blue Raja cosplay? I think you're the amazing. only one that commented on it, that cosplay. Maybe, yeah. yeah it's it, a deep cut. It was a great comment, by the way. It got my attention. I was like, oh, this girl, ooh, a pretty girl, commenting on the, the blue Raja. All right, better uh -huh. respond. Yeah, and he did, and he did respond. So yeah. that was our first interaction together. Was over YouTube via the Dragon Con video and via Blue Raja. That's that's how it. So. it began. Yeah. And then a couple days later, uh, we were following each other on Instagram. Yeah, you followed me on Instagram. I followed her on Instagram. I fangirled hard <laughs> on Instagram. I was I fanboying myself. I couldn't believe it. But... I couldn't believe this beautiful, like, gorgeous girl was like talking to me tampa j what the heck this guy that goes around with his camera and uh doesn't know what to say half the time um this this was like going on in the background as i'm like traveling and, and you know doing my thing and i'm like wow this this can't be real uh, and then i think i slid into her d you sure did yeah so so far, I was like comment. We were kind of commenting back and forth on YouTube via his videos. I haven't even launched my channel yet. And um, a few days later, after you followed me on Instagram, that I posted a picture on my story of me getting my brand new iPhone 13. Right. And that's when he slid into my DMs. He slid into my DMs first. I was people. lurking and I was I was like, you know, oh, she got it. She yeah. no lie. You got you got a phone the same day I got a phone. Yeah. And I took that as like, ooh, that's an opportunity to, uh, you know, say something. Hey, you know, it was innocent. <laughs> it was. It was. Yeah. But I slid in those DMs. Yeah. I took advantage of the opportunity, the coincidence. There's no thing as coincidence. Yeah. By the way. And uh, yeah. And it was the best day of my buddies. life. Yeah, best it, day of my I life. I was yeah. so beyond excited and happy that this like huge YouTuber that I was like what? absolutely falling in love with was like actually talking to me. Like I did, it did not feel like real uh, life. And I, was I, did, so I felt the same way. I was like, again, I was like, what, what does this girl want to do with this guy? He's got like a gap in his teeth and he's like. <laughs> His hair is under his cap all the time, and but um, yeah, yeah, and then love at first sight. But then when we first started to get to know each other, you know, I could see your your posts and everything. I love that she liked plants and she liked nature because that's a big part of this channel. And it has been, and I saw that you we were into the same things like movies and music. You know, that's a bonus when you know when um, you have the same hobbies and interests. Um, as your, you know, yeah, as your girlfriend or significant other, yeah, that's that is huge. But we're in so many ways are the same person, and uh, the biggest thing that we got out really fast is that we both were in the same kind of uh, music scene mm -hmm. at the same time. But we're talking back in like uh, like the, a decade ago, the late two yeah. thousands. You were in a um, you were in a ska band mm -hmm. that played with my hardcore band in the Kissimmee area, area. and we, we put this at the end of the video. So if you've been paying attention, again, go back. Yeah. You could put this all together. If yep. you've watched every video, we're just repeating ourselves. Mm -hmm. We're just putting it all in one video. But we concluded that we had, at one point, we're in the same room at the same time, like years ago. And 
I don't know too many people that know. It was such a small community. Yeah. It was a hardcore Christian music scene. Yeah. Um, we played churches. We played bars. Um, all over the place. All over Florida. I toured. Uh, you toured a little bit within Florida, but at, it, it's a very small um, era. And also, a, a time in life that I always think of a good time in my life, you know, like, but the fact that you already knew what, you know, you knew, that was a huge part of my life, so you already knew what, yeah, what that was. Yeah, you didn't have to explain anything, it's like, yeah. yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And then I launched my channel and you actually got to see me So that was that, talk and... That was, uh, that was a big thing. I'm like, oh my gosh, this girl, she's got a YouTube channel, and I, I immediately, I think I watched your first video October 15th. Mm -hmm. 2021 was your first video yeah. and you went to um, the Hershey Gardens and she became an annual past member mm -hmm. she was living in Hershey Pennsylvania when yeah. this all went down I was living in Tampa not this apartment that we we moved together mm -hmm. the one I moved uh, into not not very uh, long before that and um, so yeah so technically it started on YouTube but it went into Instagram and then yeah. eventually we were following each other on everything mm -hmm. And commenting then, back and forth on each other's videos and on each other's Instagram posts and whatnot. Do you remember um, me sending your, me your phone number? Oh my god, yeah. I sent you my phone number. <laughs> About a month after I sent that first comment on the YouTube video, about a month after that, early November, um, it was actually right after... Uh, Halloween. Yes. So after the spooky and, season. And ended. side note for me, so Halloween happened for me. I was in Pennsylvania and um I was kind of in a bit of a low place um mentally and kind of physically and just in general. And I just remember thinking at the time you were uh, going through a crazy airplane like thing oh. over with the go like yeah, so Halloween. yeah, my I got deplaned on the yeah. Connecticut airport and I decided to rent a car and head to New York City. This all was like bam, boom, yeah. bang, and, and I was on the road. I, I wasn't just, far from Pennsylvania. Yeah, exactly, and I just remember like thinking a lot like, man, if he, if he was stranded here, I was going to offer to let him stay at my place and try not to be creepy about it. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm sure you, you would have gotten that a lot, but yeah. like, you know, I was just like, somehow, like I knew in my mind, somehow we are meant to be together. Like we're supposed yeah. to be together. And I remember I felt like that way. whole month of October just being like, kind of sad about it and excited, but also just kind of sad because it's like, this is, this is my person. Uh, this is my person like just from yeah. watching his YouTube videos and yeah. and seeing how he was I was just like this is the man I'm supposed to be with that's how do I get his attention like how do I really get his attention the busiest man in the entire world how do I get him to notice me and to realize that he needs to be with me too like that was constantly in my mind throughout the whole month of October is like I need to be with this person Please, like I, I put it out into the universe like every day like please make this happen like this is the person I need to be with I make know. it happen well, and I made a huge huge final plea like on on Halloween like please make the, like I want him in my life put him in my life please and um and vice versa too like I knew that I could be the person for him we felt the um, same exact way and then and just a couple days later it was he was that's exactly what happened i had a Which jump it, yeah i had a we had a jump start because we got to know each other because of our videos yeah and wow you know going back to that first video i was like wow this this girl is amazing she's sweet she's kind she's uh you know generous with her words and she's very thoughtful and reflects a lot loves the things i love i'm like wow Honestly, I was like, how can I get a girl like that? Like, I, I didn't know that, you know, that we already had each other. We were destined to be together. And I know that sounds like science fiction stuff, but... but that's exactly what happened. When you know, you when know. When you know, you and know. And I heard that my entire life. You know, we've both been in relationships before. Yep. 
you know, we both had bad, uh, bad ones, good mm -hmm. ones, um, mostly bad. Yep. And I thought I was in love uh, once before. I, I thought, I thought I was, but I wasn't. And I, I didn't know that until I met Chris. Yeah, same. Yeah. Same. So it was the universe that aligned, um, you know, yeah. that brought us together and it was inevitable. And we got to know each other and I knew in my heart that I had, even though I'm busy, you know, we both work uh, Monday through Friday and I, I'm doing the YouTube on the weekends, hustling, you know, trying to get to places I want to see, like haunted houses, filming locations. But I knew in the back of my mind and in my heart that I had to make arrangements to go up and see you and so mm -hmm. we got to know each other for you know a month or two yeah it was a, it was a month so, I, and it actually happened kind of a funny story but it did actually yeah. happen really through a photo on my instagram story of my refrigerator oh yeah refrigerator we, buddies we had as the well. exact same with the same refrigerator yeah too. with a bunch of magnets on it and all, Getting all married. Of that stuff so <laughs> that was that was kind of the start of it and then we spent all night and all the next day talking. and night talking via instagram just about everything i don't really. think we've stopped talking nope. since that moment like no nope. we had like i mean this is my best friend right here and i would do anything for her and I, I have got to know this girl, and uh, she's got to know me, mm -hmm. talking for you there, mm -hmm. like no other, you know, like yep. we're inseparable. And I'm really grateful that we're able to share our relationship, document it. I, um, I'm going to go back, and we'll, we'll keep going forward, but I have never had anything like this, and uh, I, I'm going to say it right here. I, I, I've said it, I've asked her to marry me on camera, but I have to repeat it. There is no one in this world that has ever made me happier than you. And right here on this Valentine's Day, documenting documenting this for everyone, I just want you to know that um, you know love is real, and it's you know it's it's not necessarily um, you know a relationship. Love is everywhere. It's 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 within us all. It's the it's not just the people we care about. It's it's the things we care about too. You know, so I'm not saying that there is, um, you know, there's an answer to every question, but I just know that once you experience the love I have for Chris the girl, you never want to experience um, anything else like that. You know, like I, I'm just so thankful and grateful. And I want to document it here on my channel and on your channel. I want to put it out there because this is our, this is our moment. So the camera died. Yeah, I didn't know out. that. That that tells you I've never let my camera uh, yeah, roll more rolled. than 15 minutes. Yep. That's the first time because I thought my battery died. But they we started at the same time. So we know yep. we're 15 minutes in. Yeah. But I, yeah, I just wanted to put that into existence. This is our channel. Um, it may not necessarily be um, the message that everyone is looking for right now, um, but this pertains to us. And we are just so grateful we can share this with you. So thank yeah. you so much and for watching. That's yeah. what I was trying to say. And, and we really, yeah. yeah, we really appreciate that. In and, general, yeah. And I think, yeah, exactly what you just said. Like, it may not be the message that you need right now. Because I know we both have been in the place where yeah. that was what people may have been telling She's us. better with words than I have. That's but it. But it was not yeah. the time or the place for us to be able to receive or understand what that message meant. I think we were probably some of the most cynical people out there when it came to love. Oh, I like, was done. That was not, nope. that was not, a yeah. thing. like that was not something that I thought existed like at uh, all. Right. Or it, or it wasn't meant for me or whatever it was, yeah. like it just wasn't, happening so i didn't believe any of that stuff and you out there may be feeling the same way yeah you and could I totally get it me too i've been totally there totally get it yeah but uh when you do find that person or even that thing that hobby or or a pet or whatever it may be honestly it could be anything um it could be a you, youtube channel you, yeah exactly um you realize when something fits and is right for you at that time, like it's like, whoa, like, okay, now I get it. Now I get it. <laughs> yeah. 
when you know you know and that was like a thing my parents used to say and i'm like oh yeah 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 but it, it's true it's true it is legitimately true yeah everything that i don't think we really have to say this because we always try to um you know be as genuine be real. and real as possible with you all but i'll say it anyway like everything that we portray to you all on the YouTubes and via our social medias and stuff like that is true. Like we yeah. just love each other yeah. uh, to no end. Oh. Oh. I don't know where I would be without, without you. Sorry, I'm trying to hold it together. You got it. I feel uh, the same way. I don't know where I'd be without you. I've, yeah, so. I've been through, you know, we both been through yeah. so much the last few years, you know, and she came into my life when she was supposed to. Exactly. The other day I was like, man, I wish I would have met you years ago. And you said yeah. the perfect thing. We weren't ready for each other. No, not at all. And I believe in that. You know, I'm not the same person. You're not the same person you were 10 years ago. No, no. way. It's the things that we go through that make us who we are. And maybe we don't know the exact purpose of all of this. But I do know, just just the 30-something years that I've been living here, um, that we, for a reason, go through things that not necessarily you know why at that moment, why they're happening, but those things add up. And down the road, you think back and you're like, wow, I get it. Yeah. If, that I hadn't, that, if that didn't happen to me and I didn't go through that, this would have never happened. And that's, honestly, that's, that's how I feel a lot, you know, meeting Chris. And uh, we said it. Um, it's, again, another cliche, but it's a great song. I thought love was only true in fairy tales. Yeah. Uh, until I met Chris the girl, but it's true. And yeah. um, I just, I love you to bits and pieces. And um, I, I, yeah, I, I love saying this, I'd kill for you. <laughs> and I am so grateful. I, I get to spend the rest of my life with my best friend <laughs> i love you me too and um i love you guys and i love bella, bella. and hey. shout out to chris's parents love you all yeah. mom love you um thanks for all everyone's support you know um uh, in the comment sections our friends uh one thing that that eats on me and i know it eats on you all the time is you know we're working we're making videos we're editing there's a lot of work that goes into yeah two channels right here in this household um i feel bad you know there's sometimes you know if we don't see the if we don't respond to a comment it's because we didn't see it because we really try to get back to everyone but you know it, it's really hard and that that really eats at me so even if i don't respond um please know that we do look over all the comments and our hearts are for you guys and we genuinely love you and appreciate you watching and it would not be the same without you without you yes we're talking to you it would not be and um yeah so yeah you want to continue with the story a yeah. little bit we're gonna get back to that we're gonna go on yeah. tangents it's gonna yeah, be a long I'm video i'm sure yeah yeah um but yeah so eventually you did send me your number and then we started talking normally through text and whatnot and um i think we were both kind of playing it a little hard to coy, get a little like <laughs> we don't want to come off as creepers I however i no. love you and i want to spend the rest of my life with you right <laughs> so i remember there was a moment and i you're gonna you're, i think you already know what i'm talking about so being a youtuber and you know being in my 30s and knowing what i know about dating and you know and just always working it's like you get your you get your courage up and i had the ultimate courage and i basically said hey i like you i think this is a good idea i think we should get to know each other i i can't i can't remember how exactly i worded that basically but that's what yeah. i did i just went out on a limb because yep. i knew like you know there, let's just not waste time let's just get because i feel it in my heart mm -hmm. i like this girl i potentially um am about to buy a ticket if she says yes i'm gonna get on a plane and go see her and, and that's that's what happened yeah. yeah i believe you said you had the biggest crush on me i did that's not, it <laughs> if I'm not and i did 
Yep. I still do. Yep. And I said the same thing. So yeah. we were both. Best day of like, my life. Yep. Yep. Same here. I I will never ever ever forget that moment. So. Yeah, and then very shortly after, maybe even the day after that or something, you were like, hey, I'm looking at plane tickets. How about I right. come on over and First of we December. hang out? Yeah. And I was like, yeah, let's do it. And I was really excited because it's like, okay, he's serious. I'm serious. This is great. I don't want to play games. Just, just like he said. We're going to come up and we're going to vlog. We're gonna, we both have YouTube channels. We're going to collaborate. Mm -hmm. And uh, get to you know go on our first date and all yep. that, and uh, so I boarded a plane, uh, left Tampa I believe on a Thursday morning. I took the day off, and you know a special occasion, got to take the day off, and I flew up for the weekend, and it's out there. Those videos are out there. They are out there. But um, I rented a car at the uh, Harrisburg Airport. It's just like a 30-minute drive from Hershey. I think I, I'm gonna fix the light. Oh, the light yeah. went out. So yeah, 30 minute drive from Hershey. Um, I was there. Um, it was the morning time. She was still working. So I got there a little early. And uh, there you were. The first time I ever saw you was there. And we showed it in the um, Dark Nights Hershey yes. uh, Park oh, video yeah, back in over um, October. We showed the Christmas. apartment. Yeah. Oh yeah, it was Christmas. Well, the first time. But I mean, oh yeah, we didn't oh, really yeah, show yeah, yeah. it that time. I gotcha. Yeah. But yeah, we, we I was there for Christmas, and uh, there she was in her apartment door. I'll never forget that moment. And uh, that night, we went out to eat, and we had dinner, and the next day, um, we went to Hershey Gardens. That well, was our first, not Hershey Gardens, Hershey Park. I'm, yeah, I'm screwing and we, this up. Well, we... <laughs> the like so we... <laughs> Go ahead. We, um... So you flew over, and, yeah. um... We... Yeah, we went to my favorite Poke Bowl place and um, got food and then we went over to the Hershey Hotel. Hershey Hotel, that's right. And we walked around there for a while. And that was beautiful. Um, by yeah, the that way. was really beautiful. And we had the whole place to ourselves. Yeah. Big grand hotel compared to like the hotel the Grand Floridian at Walt Disney World and Yeah. They had a tree out back. We took pictures. Yeah, those we were took our pictures. first moments we were together. We so happy. Yeah, it was, it was truly our first date. And I was reflecting together. on your video because you made a video, and I was just reliving that with you. And I'm like, oh man, I can't believe I'm here with this. Wow, with this amazing person, and she's beautiful, yeah. and we're just hitting it off really well. Mm -hmm. And and going back to yeah. when you when I first opened the door to see Tampa J and on my doorstep, which was like. Whoa, like I, <laughs> I'm I here. dreamed this moment for so long Honestly, and it, it like, finally happened. I was scared you're going to open the door and be like, oh no, that's what he looks like <laughs> in the real? No, I was like, I knew, I already no, I knew that this was the man for me, but the second that I saw him, it was like, okay, yeah. affirmation, this is it. This is, this is definitely the person for me. Yeah, so, I knew um, before I got there. You, I think you knew before you yeah. got there, but that moment, but that right was there, like solidified. Like, it. okay, yes, this is this is it. And then, um, also in my apartment, very shortly after we met, yeah, is when you asked me to be officially your girlfriend. Yeah, it was like very quickly. Very quickly, yeah. Because we just knew, and I was yeah. like, let's we make this knew, official. But yeah, we hadn't even been on a first date really mm -hmm. physically, you know, but yeah. We had been talking, getting to know each other. Yeah. And when you know, you know. Yeah. And so. that still one of the best, the best weekend of my life. Getting agreed. To yeah. know you and yeah. And then we went to Hershey Park and we vlogged that. That yeah, was our that first was video a vlog. together. Vlog, yes. Hershey so. Park, Christmas, 2021. Yeah. And you all saw the glow in our eyes <laughs> and our faces. You were like, who's this girl Everybody in that guy's knew, video? And we were like yeah. trying to keep it on the DL and all that yeah, stuff. Yeah, because we, but you know, we. You know, you don't want to shock everyone at first. You yeah. Want to, you want yeah, to let so them know gradually. Into but it. Yeah. We did. It was obvious. You could see it all over our faces. Yeah. And a year ago, we we announced it officially. We went through Christmas mm -hmm. um, on Valentine's Day at the Tampa Theater. Yeah. But um, 
yeah, so that's where it began. And then mm -hmm. two months later, you were here. Yeah. Actually, less because, than that. Yeah, yeah really. Um, just a couple weeks. A couple weeks, just yeah. Because I started to come home for Christmas. Yeah, and, and that whole that whole weekend, yeah. I was just, I think we both were just obviously having the time of our lives, but also like in the back of our minds, like, yeah. You're gonna have to go back, back to Florida. Yeah, that sucked. And we knew like we're supposed to be together, so what we were, do like we have to figure what this do out? Do yeah. yeah. So, um, basically that day, if not the next day, we we're just like, oh well, what if I come down for Christmas to Florida? Cause I work from home, so I can technically work from anywhere. Yeah. And um, great idea. And you were all for it. Yeah, too, come on down. So. Um, I was yeah. like, all right, well, in two weeks, I'll, I'll be there. And you were. And my, my mom was down for Christmas, and my grandpa, and we, and my brother, uh, his birthday, Christmas Eve, so it just all worked out. Like, she got to meet my mom, and my grandpa, mm -hmm. and my brother. Yeah, very early on. Very early on. And then um, we, <laughs> the very first video we did, yeah, took you to the, we did the Tampa sign yeah. together. Bella! Bella! Is it is it that doggy in the window again? Here. Oh. Yeah. We'll pause here. We'll pause here. Okay, so yeah, we went through Christmas. Mm -hmm. Um it's all out there, all the videos. Yeah. I wanna talk about how we went to Arizona to meet your parents. Mm -hmm. Like we like we were so sure that we, I was like, I gotta meet your parents, you mm -hmm. know? You gotta meet my parents. And wow, we within two months we had already been on like basically two road trips, because we yeah. did go on one to New Jersey mm -hmm. while I was in Pennsylvania, while mm -hmm. I came up that weekend. We went to uh, Story Yeah, we already did a lot of traveling together. But, man, that Arizona trip was like the time of my life. Yeah, mm -hmm. I, I fell in love with, you know, your parents too, and uh, Daisy, your your parents' dog, and Arizona is yeah. beautiful out there, the Sorora cactuses, and then we went to Tombstone, and uh, I had a connection with Tombstone with my grandparents, and it was just, the most magical time and each and every time we do something we just always find each and one of our adventures we go on our trips you know what i love about us and you is we we enjoy the little things we yeah. don't let the you know when things go wrong we don't let it stress us out we don't have to tell each other you know don't stress out because we're both the same you know mm -hmm. um that's one thing i really love about us and what I love about Chris is that um, she is the most understanding person and supportive um, human being uh, that's ever been in my life and you know besides you know my mom and my parents but she just gets me and um, I you know we finish each other's sentences sometimes and we like the same things and we just jive jive with the same vibes and it's hard it's really hard to sum it up into words unless uh, i'm sure there's people out there that know have that same with someone else but um i'm just very grateful and lucky to have you in my life thank you and the same way i am looking forward to forever with you and i will shout that from a mountaintop i will I've shouted it from the top of a garage. Mm -hmm. We will get to a mountain someday, but yeah. um, and I feel I'm just same. so proud of you. That's what I'm trying to say. Yeah, I feel the same way, and he's yeah. he's the most amazing person. No, it's you. In the entire Thank world, you. so what initially attracted me to him was just I think a lot a lot of people have actually shared these same sentiments, which is amazing to me as yeah. well and just proves like, um, you know, how much people really truly love you and your channel, but he's just the most genuine person in the world and so sweet and so thoughtful. And I never really saw anybody on the YouTubes like bear his soul like that. Like there's so many things that you share and, um, you can just tell like how sincere that you are and I just completely like I don't know I never met anybody That's... like that before and of course so funny and so talented like the videos just are amazing and 
um, you know, so creative and smart and um, just, you know, we are interested in like all the same things. Like I can't tell you how many videos I watch. I'm just like, oh my gosh, he likes this too. Oh wow, I like that. That's so <laughs> we cool. That we have all, all the stuff that we have in common. And um, so I just feel like the luckiest person in the entire world. Like it's my best friend, like the... We feel the same. Yeah. I, I'm the luckiest person. I always commented uh, on her videos after I watch her, you know, video. I say, Chris, the girl with that heart of gold, because she's everything more than she just described me being. She's the most kindest, sweetest, most genuine person um, I've ever known. And when I clicked on her videos, I was like, wow, this is, this is someone I trust. This is someone um, who I want to get to know because she is all the more she makes me a better person she has amplified um first of all thank you for those compliments i love you babe but you have made me a better person at all of that and because you are the person i've always wanted to be you that's what that's how you stole my heart you know you inspire me every day i'm so proud of you too with your channel you know i was telling her today i was watching her videos like wow these are you know all your videos are great but they just keep getting better and better and and um especially you know the editing and everything you just you just she works harder than anyone i know and that's because she's passionate about what she is doing and that's another thing i love about her is she's just she always wants to go the extra step and that's how i am that's how i've always been we always try to go the extra step but how do we do it um, differently and how do we do it um, humanely you know we don't want to step on anyone's toes we want to get back to everyone we want to do this together and I am so happy to be a proud of such a great team the best team I've ever had Chris Me and Jay too. yeah we push yeah. each other to 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 be better and to do better not in like a yeah. not in a pushy way but just in a like right. we, we just and we inspire each other is what I'm trying to say. You know, we have we have bad days just like everyone. Our relationships aren't perfect. You know, we don't we don't want to you know, put us, you know, paint a yeah. a, a perfect picture. Yeah. But one thing I've never had, you know, ever that I have with Chris is that we're able to you know, call each other out um in the best way possible like just because of communication you know we know how to communicate to each other you know sometimes you might be having a bad day and you know you you'll say something and i'll be like you know what i i probably should be in a better mood i should, probably shouldn't have said this that way but it wasn't like she um got on to me or yelled at me it was just it was the perfect thing you know i can't think of an example right now but yeah well yeah, yeah. i mean we have plenty of yeah, our own things that we that happen. Like you said, no yeah. no relationship is perfect and yeah. um you know, we have plenty of miscommunications and and this and that and that and this and it's hard. Like it's not easy to yeah. both have channels and you know, go to the same places and the vlog the same things. Oh, like yeah. there's yeah. a lot of things that go into that that I think a lot of people don't really realize and um so there's a lot of stuff that we've already like had to work through and and still work on and whatnot like yeah i definitely don't want to sit here and be like we have the best like the most <laughs> perfect there's never any problems yeah. at all because that's not true it's not real that's not real and that's not something that we want to portray but at the end of the day like we both love each other and respect the heck out of each other so right. much um it's the best I've... we always grow after yeah. each uh you know issue that we it's have the, it's the best relationship it's the perfect it's it one be. yeah i've always imagined being in and yeah so that's the that's story the of story us. of us yeah everything else is out <laughs> there on the youtube so <laughs> yeah so it, this might be a long up. one but hey it's uh it's been a long time coming and yeah it's a subject matter that is it definitely uh needed to be put out there yeah yeah so 
Yeah, happy Valentine's That's Day. It. Yeah, happy Valentine's Everyone. Day. Everyone. Now we're getting in. Getting married someday. We're gonna get married. Yeah, so that's the next step. When are yeah. we gonna do that? Yeah, I don't know. Where are we gonna do that? I don't know. <laughs> Watch your head. <laughs> yeah, do you like us? Do you like us together? Do you like us? Yeah, I think that's a yes. I think so. All right, that's gonna do it for this video. I really hope that that was inter as entertaining as it can be. And um, I had a good time. yeah, I did too. And I'm I'm so glad that we finally sat down and shared our story. Um, it's the most important story that I have out of, the universe. out of my entire entire life because it brought me to this person. It's the story of us. And um, so I really appreciate you all watching and uh, hopefully you had a good time. Thank Once you. again, please, um, if, if you can, if, um, if you'd like, Click on at least Tampa J's video again if you want to give it a quick thumbs up or a quick comment or something like that. Um, we would really, really, really appreciate it. You don't have to, but it's always uh, it's always appreciated. Come but especially over. in this case when once again we really just sat down both cameras and yeah. talked. So, um, but yeah. Um, and then other than that, I guess that's a. Uh, that's a wrap. That's it. Thanks, everyone. Yeah, thank you. I for really watching. enjoyed this, and uh, the pizza was great. The pizza was good. Happy Valentine's. Happy Day, Valentine's Day, everybody! And now we're onward to the next holiday. So okay, bye bye, everybody. We'll see you very, very, What's the next very one? soon. Easter? No, St. Patty's Day. Ah, I should know that. Huh? President's Day technically yeah. coming oh, up okay. on Monday, Day. I guess, but St. Patty's that. Day maybe. Yeah, I don't know. We may have some plans this weekend. You we never might. know. Oh yeah, we do have plans this weekend. I know okay. it's so great. Bye everybody. See bye you bye. soon. See you very very soon. Bye bye. Look, he's made of that. By the way, check out the Valentine's Day card that I got today from Tampa J. You're welcome. Is this not the most perfect card for me that I, you. that I could have ever received <laughs> from Tampa J? It was made for him to give to me. Flamingo together. We <laughs> flamingo together. Yeah, that's you and that's me with our with our sunglasses. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, it's adorable. It's it's literally See, perfect. I, I I just had to show you, so I, I made yeah. that your card. Thank you, thank you. And last year, last Valentine's Day, you also gave me a flamingo, a flamingo card. card. It's a yeah, so now it's a tradition that may be very hard to follow up next year, but. Uh oh. You'll just have oh. to. You'll just Hit have me to with a challenge. Okay, well. <laughs> challenge has to be accepted now. Thank challenge. You. Thanks accepted. all. Accepted. Thanks all for watching. Bye, everybody. See you very, 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 very soon. Very soon. Okay, bye bye. bye, -bye.